Hey, I'm Kevin with Godlike Incorporated and Totally Wicked Audio, and I'm here at the 2017 NAM show in Hall E at the Delhi Magazine Stompbox exhibit. Um, you may know Godlike. For many years, we've been the distributor of a lot of boutique effect brands like Maxon, uh, Emma, and our own Power All uh, power supplies. But for the past couple of years, we've been releasing, uh, building, building and designing our own pedals under the Totally Wicked Audio brand. And this year, we finally feel like we've got a line of pedals to show you guys. And so here we are back at NAMM, uh, demoing them and, and displaying them for everybody. So new for this year, we have uh, two pedals coming out. One is called Hot Sake. Uh, Hot Sake is based on the Maxon SD9 Sonic Distortion. We get a lot of players uh, asking to try the SD9, and when they use it in a band context, it kind of gets lost. So what we did was we added a mid-range, a dedicated mid-range control that allows you to bump your mids a little bit, a lot more gain and a lot more output so it can get up on top of a band. In addition, we added a low boost switch, which just kicks in a little more low end, and it really changes the whole character of the pedal. So from at one point, you're going from a, more of an overdrive kind of thing, and once you put the low boost on, you're really into a, a big muff, almost fuzz type territory. So we call it, you know, the hot sake overdrive slash distortion. It's a little bit of both, but it's really great. And uh, we're gonna let our buddy here, Tom Hotzi Emanuel, play through it and let you hear it for a little bit. So here's clean sound. to kick on the low boost switch which is going to give you a little more of like a, a full body almost big muff type of type of effect okay so that's the hot sake from totally wicked audio that's shipping now and next and uh one we're really, really excited about is the TWA Dynamorph. And the Dynamorph is uh, a unique type of fuzz pedal. It uses two cascading preamps into a string of diode rectifiers. And what happens is the, the, uh, the preamps drive the diodes and the diodes bias in positive, negative, or not at all. And then all that is blended together uh, via the op amp. And what you get is just a, ver a bunch of stacked uh, saturation waveforms, sometimes square, sometimes triangle, sometimes a combination of both waveforms combined with clean, and it just creates a really interesting filtering effect, uh, like a tonal filtering, but also a lot of compression when you dig in with notes, and it's all very dynamically responsive. So if you play light, it's uh, less distortion, but if you dig in really hard, you get this really almost synth-like saturation and filtering going on. So what we're gonna do is, in addition to the, the standard distortion uh, circuit on that we also added a volume envelope that you could turn on and once you turn the volume envelope on it swells your volume of the guitar playing into the effect so you it, it creates a lot more playing dynamics and reaction uh, with the actual fuzz effect that's occurring with the pedal itself so we're gonna start with the standard just uh, just drive mode and Tom's going to play a little bit. So this is with a, a low drive setting. So play a little bit. And then as we turn up the drive, you start to get that really sizzly compression and saturation and, and filtering to the notes. Now I'm going to turn up the second drive setting. And you hear that? just alone and now we're gonna add in the envelope mode which just it, it's really dependent on your picking dynamics but it just gives you a little bit of a, a swell into your uh, into your pick attack and that triggers the uh, the distortion circuit differently than than it normally does and it just adds a lot more playing dynamics and beautiful volume swells you can get some synth like volume swells and a lot of other really cool interesting unique effects
butterfly LED display is actually reacting to his plane dynamics now. WA Hot Sake and Dynamorph from NAM 2017. You can check these pedals out more at our website, www.godlike.com. I'm Kevin from Godlike signing off. Thanks for watching.